Hi friends, remember me? Today we're going to be discussing where I've been during the month of August and just what you can expect moving forward from here. I made a post on Instagram at the beginning of August essentially that I was taking August off. If I had the capability of doing the posts on, on YouTube I would have done that as well. Uh, but I posted on Twitter and on Instagram that I was taking the month of August off of social media and YouTube and everything. There were so many reasons. Uh, I was definitely burnt out after July camp just so much like I was doing four videos a week I wrote 24 ish 25 ish thousand words um, I did probably 15 live streams it just was a lot and I toward the end of the month uh, my sister got sick and I was taking care of my niece and it just it was like so much stuff that it just was like okay I need a breather I'm going to just kind of make August kind of like a lackey month and I was going to just do one video a week or do what I needed to do or what I felt you know like I had time to do then things went a little south from there I'm not gonna go into like a full in-depth discussion of my sister's medical history because I don't feel like that's anybody's business but hers and also I don't want to bore you but just suffice it to say that my sister has been very ill she's been having to have a lot of surgeries and she's not really capable of living on her own right now or taking care of her 12 year old daughter so they have been living with me and I've been helping take care of her and running my niece to all of her practices football games and school and just all of that because we're I don't live in the same school district so I have to take her to school every day and it's just this big huge thing and so once that started happening, once my sister spent any time in the hospital, I just, I knew that August was not going to happen. Even just doing what little I thought I could do, I knew that it was going to be more of, okay, take August off, figure out what's going on, figure out how to adapt into this new life that you're going to be living for a while and, and go from there. And at this point in the juncture, we're still not 100% sure what all's going on. And there's still going to be more tests, more doctor visits, a lot more of that going on. Um, I know that they're going to be here for at least another month. So it's still not great moving forward. Um, I don't, ha we don't have a lot of answers. So um, just doing what we can when we can. Obviously we got Jazz too. We have my sister's dog. She's here too. She sleeps with me. She's like my new best friend. She loves me. So I have five dogs in my house now. That's five dogs and a 12 year old. Super fun. So moving forward, I think I finished one book in August. I did no writing in August whatsoever. I've read a little bit of a couple of different books. I've been working on my uh, September arcs and I really haven't gotten through any of those either but I've been trying. My goal is to go back to filming. I want to get at least one video a week up. I want to get back to doing the things that I enjoy. I just know that for a while until we know for sure what's going on it's going to be a little sporadic and it's just going to be what I can when I can. I do know for sure that September's AuthorTube chat is just basically going to be like a welcome back party. Um, so it's going to be me and Kate and some of our other friends are just going to be doing like a live chat and just hanging out um, with each other and with those of you who we see in our chats all the time. I don't know exactly when we're going to be doing that but I will definitely let you know. When we plan to do that I will post on social media and here um, and let you guys know what we're planning on doing. Um, there are a few other things that I want to discuss so let's get into that. First off, I want to thank all of you who are still here and stuck it out through a month of absolutely no videos from me. Despite the fact that my viewership is down 80%, I've actually still gained like 70 subscribers this month, which means that people are still watching my content and that's great. Also, one of the really interesting things that, like, I don't want to tell everyone to take a month off, but really, take a month off. You get such a better view of what is popular on your channel, what people are searching for, uh, what people are actually spending their time watching, because there's nothing new to, like, grab people's attention. So I can see, like, what my top five videos were for this month, and I know that they are 
older videos because it wasn't like something was brand new and it is in one of the top five spots, which is usually the case. It's very interesting to see what of my channel people prefer to watch. At this point in time, my highest watched videos are my planner videos, which I do plan to incorporate more planner videos and I have discussed that in the past. I just didn't think that those were like the most viewed videos that I had. It was interesting. Those and my, uh, my bookshelf tour, which that's to be expected. I didn't expect the planner videos to be so high. I expect, I expect the bookshelf tour to be high, but planner videos was not on my list of things I was expecting, so it's just interesting. Anyway, I will stop rambling at you. Um, again, I am going to try to get back into regular videos. I'm going to try to post at least once a week. I want to do two a week, but it's really just going to depend. I mean, I go to work. I have to leave the house about 45 minutes earlier than I was leaving before so that I can get Danica to school. And then after work, I have to get her to choose cheerleading practice and or tumbling and or a football game literally Monday through Friday. So it's it's been interesting to say the very least. So that's it for me and Jazz today. We are going to sign off for now. If I'm having any chat videos on this couch, you can expect to see Jazzy here because she loves to sit with me because she's a little weirdo. Again, thank you. I love you guys. Thank you for being here. Thank you for continuing to watch my channel and continuing to support me even when times are not as wonderful as they could be and I appreciate all of the messages and words and everything that I've been getting on Instagram and Twitter and in my comment section and just everything that you guys have been doing for me all month long even though I haven't even been here. I greatly appreciate you all. Thank you again and look forward to some videos coming up in the very near future. I will talk to you guys later. Bye!